This week's match of the week goes to Dylan Anderson for his finals match at the Dactronics. Uh, if you guys haven't gotten a chance to see it, figure out a way to get to, to see this match. Um, Dylan did a, an unbelievable job wrestling through multiple, multiple positions, incredible scrambles throughout the match. I, I know he hit a lot of shots and I fended them off with a whizzer and I think that was a taste into what the rest of the match was going to look like. Um, he probably took 20 shots, low singles, sweep singles, um, and all of them I scrambled out of and wizzered out of and that's frustrating to put that on a guy but um, by the third period going uh, one to one after both of our escapes choosing down I was able to pick up a takedown. Um, and then fend them off for the rest of the period and get the win. Uh, There's numerous times where it looked like Dylan was was going to get taken down or even get going to get put to his back, and he wrestled out of those positions. And he just did an unbelievable job hustling through positions, um, never giving up uh, when it looked like he was going to get taken down, and um, and scrambling. And I think sometimes people think of scrambling as as um, just something that happens. Um, creatively or abstractly but a lot of times scrambling there's a there's a system to it and there's a way to do it and a way not to do it and and Dylan did a really good job of staying heavy on the guy and um, applying pressure when when he needed to and taking pressure off when he needed to and, um, and then coming up with a big leg attack and a big takedown there to win the match. I felt really good about the way I wrestled. Um, one thing I think I could have done better in that last match especially is um, not let him get to my feet as much in the first place. A lot of those, um, a lot of those positions I am comfortable in, but there was a few moments there that it could have gone either way on, on him getting him to take down or not. Um, so staying on my toes and staying aggressive and not being on my heels would have prevented him from getting down on my legs as much as he did. Dylan's fun to watch and he's going to be really fun to watch for Gopher fans this year, just the way, the way he never gives up and he wrestles through all positions and so uh, happy for him but it's just the start to the season and, and we're looking forward to some great things uh, coming out of Dylan after, after this.